Summer is the season when people tend to show more skin. But how does your skin look? If you're like most people, your skin is probably a little less than red carpet ready. I spoke with Kate Somerville, a paramedical esthetician known as the skin care expert to the stars, about getting your skin to look its very best. Kate Somerville, skin expert to the stars. Thanks so much for taking the time to talk with us today, Kate. Thank you. Kate, let's talk a little bit about your mental condition and your skin. How do those two relate? Well, definitely relate. You know, I've worked on clients, you know, younger kids that have acne, and that really causes havoc at school. Um, they don't have their confidence. Um, women that are hitting old, you know, in, maybe in their 50s, and they look in the mirror and they say, you know, Kate, I still feel 22, but when I look in the mirror, I don't know who that is. It doesn't match how I feel. And so my goal is when you look in the mirror, you feel the way you look. So, you you know, it just, it does matter. So, um, you know, that's what I love about my job is I get to make people feel beautiful. The folks watching at home, how do they get to feel beautiful? What do they do if they have some acne? Maybe they're adults, maybe mm -hmm. they're young people. Maybe they've got mm -hmm. something like rosacea that's a little bit more mm -hmm. chronic and serious. What are some things that yes. they can do? Well, for acne, really important to look for ingredients that, that help with acne. Number one is something called salicylic acid, and you can find it in a wash. You can find it in a mask. Um, also, benzoyl peroxide, but be careful when you're using that ingredient because it can really dry you out. So you only want to use it, you know, to spot treat. And if you have acne and you're, you're anti-aging, you know, I'm 42, and here I get breakout now on my chin, but yet I've got to take care of the wrinkles around my eyes. So you want to look for ingredients, you know, in your anti-aging um, treatments like peptides, retinols, and you want to exfoliate twice a week, really important. So, you know, you really, if you have that combination skin, use the acne products only on the acne, not around the full face because you can cause more wrinkles. Now, you mentioned combination skin. That's a skin mm -hmm. type. Let's talk a little bit about that. How do mm -hmm. I, a guy who knows very little about skin care, <laughs> how would I figure out what my skin type is? Is it something simple or do I need to go see a dermatologist? How does that work? So, no, so simple. You know, if you feel dry, if your skin feels tight um, and you see little flakes, you're definitely dry. If you're shiny and you feel oily, you have enough oils, so you don't need a moisturizer. Um, dry skin, you need to exfoliate a little bit more. And so many of my clients get confused because they're like, well, I'm dry, I shouldn't exfoliate. But exfoliation gets rid of dead skin cells and dry skin is dead skin cells. So look for an exfoliant. In fact, we have one called Exfolicate. Um, it's my number one product. And it has little tiny grains that lift the dead skin cells. But then it has something called papaya and pineapple enzymes that dissolve the dead skin. So that's going to give you that glow instantly. It's going to get rid of that top layer that makes your wrinkles look larger um, and deeper, your pore size look larger. Larger, and it's just going to give you that red carpet beautiful glow and all your other products that you put on will work better. Okay, what are some things that we can do to take care of our skin? Do we want to watch what we eat? Do we want to be in the sun? Do we not want to be in the sun? You hear all sorts of things. Clear some I things know. up for us. Very, very, very confusing. Well, number one, you are what you eat. So, you know, I've heard dermatologists say, oh, you can eat the chocolate. But sugar really does, you know, increase sebum production. So make sure you eat lots of green leafy vegetables, drink lots of water. Um, and if you're a coffee drinker, try and drink lemon water before you drink coffee because coffee is very dehydrating and acidic. 
Um, and as far as things that you can do to kind of get that glow back, um, I love steaming. So if you're in your bath or your shower, you can put a warm cloth over your face and really hydrate that skin and that will give you a pick me up right away. Okay. There's about a million more things I would love to ask you, but unfortunately <laughs> we're running out of time. So really quickly, That's working okay. the folks at home and myself go to get some more information on taking care of our skin. Well, you can go to katesomerville.com and all of my products are sold um, at Sephora, Nordstrom's, Neiman's, and QVC. All right, super. Kate, thank you so much for chatting with us today. Best of luck to you. Thank you. Bye-bye.